in Miami. I'm in my sister's apartment. So first of all, my throat hurts really badly and it's because I'm kind of having this allergic reaction. I'm kind of like in the middle of a whole situation. Last night I was crying at the airport because I was like looking for an Uber and then I found one but then I didn't know where the station was. It was so bad. I came here and the Uber dropped me off at the wrong door. So I had to walk all by myself like two blocks with my luggage, with everything on me, my passport, my green card, everything. And I was crying. It was so scary. I've never had to do that. My mom doesn't know that. If she watches this video, she's probably gonna scream at me. But what can I say? That's what I had to do. I was so nervous and stressed and scared. And it was like a really, really bad experience. I'm gonna try a donut. That was a 8 out of 10. <gasps> no way. It has chocolate inside. And this is a plain one. I'm gonna have a little bite of that one. <coughs> my favorite one might just be the plain one. I'm all dressed up. This is a fit. I'm wearing something really casual. I'm wearing the leggings that I wore yesterday, this New York top. Now I'm going to go walk to the restaurant because I'm starving and I kind of want to go walk around, just chill for a little bit. me and looking at me weird but I did it and now I'm gonna go to city center here in Brickell just to kind of walk around and do like my own thing I kind of know this city already because I've been here so many times I want to take a picture somewhere but I don't have my tripod here with me and I'm kind of lost <laughs> this park is really cute though I'm gonna keep walking I think I'm close because I see a lot of painted walls and stuff never mind I found city center I'm literally right in front of it I'm definitely a city girl like 100% I love doing this I love just like walking around and seeing different things you guys what I bought okay so I said I was not gonna spend anything but there's certain things that I did have to spend on eventually so I was just like the vibes are good now I mean I'm in Miami by myself I can take my time to go to Sephora look for stuff there was a meet and greet by the makeup artist Mario and I was gonna take a picture with him I don't even know him I don't even buy his makeup but I was gonna take a picture with him because obviously he's a like a famous person you had to pay like a hundred dollars to see him which was insane like you had to buy his makeup in order to take a picture with him which okay I think yeah you have to pay to do like meet and greet somebody I guess but like 75 to 100 dollars that's insane but anyway I, I didn't even know who he was I just went there and there was a line I was like okay let me hop in and then this girl came and she was like oh you have to pay and I was like uh no thank you I'm gonna move on and then like half of the line left I'm gonna show you what I got at Sephora first so I got this Mate Super Goop. I've always used this. This is the one, but I'm out of the one that I have. There's just a little bit left, so 
I needed to get another one. I really love this. This is so good. And the last thing I got is this. I've heard like great things about this. It's the pistachio and salted caramel spray perfume. So I'm gonna take this to my next travel. And then I bought this for London. Look at how, like tell me it doesn't give you like Gossip Girl vibes. This is so, so cute. It had a discount. This was a must, like I had to get it. I love it. I've never had any of these because I always thought they were a waste, but to be honest, if you only wear like a plain tee and this on top and just like a pair of jeans or like pants, your outfit looks fire. So I'm definitely gonna be using this a lot. I've been learning a lot about fashion and I'm learning a lot about fashion because I actually wanna pack wisely for London because whenever I get to like places and I look at my luggage, I don't have anything. It's always overweight and I never have a good outfit. Ooh.